Hi, in this tutorial we will learn how to do the basic formatting of text in LibreOffice Calc. So we can see we have lots of cells and cells have got different data and these data are overflowing to other cells as well since this is this data is con contained in 8b but we can see it overflow to 8d so to remove it or to wrap the text and to contain the text within this 8b all we need to do is select the select the cells and then press right button of your mouse and then select format cells and then go to alignment and then check on wrap text automatically and check hyper nation active and then press ok so now we can see that the text is not not overflowing any longer also it is contained within this particular cell if you want to increase the width of this cell we can just drag it till there also we can see there are many extra white spaces so just to reduce it or to remove it we can just select the text or cells and press right button of the mouse and then click on optimal row height so now those extra spaces are removed so in case you have some random spaces between your rows let's say we have them now so this is disordered so just select the text or cells and then press right button of your mouse and then click on format cells and here then go to optimal row height and press ok so now those spaces have been reduced so if you want to specify the unit or the distance between each row then just select the rows and then press right key right, right button of your mouse and then select row height and here specify the value so let's say we want the spaces between the spaces of row so the row height should be one centimeter so just press ok now we have each rows having the size or height of one centimeter now if you want we can create border to make it look better and we can just have them bold we can also have them center aligned also to make it look better we can change the border size so let's make the border size 0.75 which is which looks really great on paper so this is how, how our table will look like we can also add color to it so let's say we want the background color of the top row so now we have added that as well so this is how we can make our table tabular data look really beautiful and presentable thank you for watching the video